Hi guys, it's Ant-Man UK here. I was in my back garden today looking around for more queens, but unfortunately I didn't find any. But I did find something quite interesting. I have this massive bush in my back garden, and while looking at it in closer inspection, I've seen lots of worker ants on it, Laceus. Um, and I was wondering what they were doing. I, uh, closer inspection, I thought, oh, are they taking these insects and killing them and taking them back to the colony? But then, you know, I thought maybe they're not because they weren't moving them. So I, um, I went online, I looked at what they were, and they are aphids. And the ants have a sort of mutual relationship with aphids. It's a 50-50 relationship, where an aphid will extract sap from the tree and convert it into nectar or honey. And the ants feed on the nectar or slash honey. And with this, in return, the ants give them um, protection and they look after them. So they will protect them from other bugs like spiders and... Uh, you know all sorts of other bugs that might kill them um, they will protect them from that also I found out that they when there's storms or rain the ants will move them underneath the leaves to protect to protect their aphids from being destroyed basically it's like us owning a farm of sheep uh, you know or us owning a farm of cows we're gonna use the cows for milk in return we give the cows grass and a grazing area and this is the same sort of thing that the ants are doing here they get full-time protection from the ants as long as they keep supplying the honeydew and nectar that the ants require also um i found out that they will take some bats to the nest uh, to, to the colony just to feed the rest of the colony not killing the aphid just extracting more nectar and honeydew from it and protecting them and then later on they return them also another great piece of information about this is the ants have a way of detecting where the sweet spots are on the bush so they will move the aphids and carry in the, carry them either on top of their head or by their pincers and they will take them somewhere else on the tree where it's more sweeter and place the aphids there and look after them that way um, as you can see here there's green and black ones uh, the black ones are the mothers so they get like priority protection from ants they will take care of the black ones more because they're the ones who are going to keep the productive cycle going and keep the ants getting nectar and honeydew anyway guys i hope you enjoy the video it's been a learning curve for me it was very interesting to see ants in the wild um, collecting honeydew uh, and nectar thanks for watching take care and i'll see you next time